I would have you fight, not only with that spirit with which you are wont to encounter other enemies, but with a certain indignation and resentment, as if you saw your slaves suddenly taking up arms against you. Yes, they are few indeed, some may say, but they are vigorous in mind and body, men whose strength and power scarce any force may withstand. On the contrary, they are but the resemblances m nay, are rather the shadows m of men, being worn out with hunger, cold, dirt, and filth, and bruised and enfeebled among stones and rocks. Let every one consider that he defends with his arms not only his own person, but his wife and young children. We must make our stand. I want you to fight with the hatred you have when you come across your enemies, and with assertion pride, as if you saw your own slaves rising up against you. There aren't very many soldiers, but they are very strong in their minds and bodies, and have a lot of power. But they are also weakened by hunger, cold, and dirt, from camping out while waiting for battle for so long. During battle, think about how you are not only saving yourself, but your wife or husband and children as well. We need to take our stand. 